I'm sure I can wait till tomorrow. Please. It can't wait. I've been dodging Chief the entire day. What is this so-called emergency? Chief has been asking me to call my parents. He wants to speak to them himself. Mm -hmm. And? And I can't keep it off much longer. Hmm, I see. You see? Are you all right? Am I not supposed to be in this thing together? Just don't panic. Stop panicking, my friend. I'm not panicking. You need to come up with a plan fast. I don't know how much longer I can, I, I can hold this off. <sighs> You're an adult. I don't need to start explaining how she was able to, you know, get the money previously from him for the clinic. I'm sure if she puts her back to it, ah, it'll be a piece of cake to rustle up a new check from him. Doctor! Ah. You can't expect to sit on your hands and collect an NYC certificate at the end of the year, Dr. George. Excuse me, sit on my... You're joking, right? Who was the one who built up this clinic in the first place? Hmm? When I first got here, this place was a dump. I am the one who got the funding, I am the one who did the renovations, and I am the one who organized the blood drive, which you were only too happy to take credit for. Oh, yes! But that couldn't have happened without the generous attention of your friend, your beloved friend, Kingsley. Isn't that a fact? <laughs> well, I expect you, Dr. George, to run along and give it your best shot, you know? <laughs> I'm willing to offer my services. Services? But you see, my services lack the equipment to get it done. Equipment? <laughs> How dare you? Who do you think you are? You slide in and out of here whenever you feel like it. Where were you the night we almost got killed? Huh? And then you took your sweet time coming back to the clinic after it all happened. Like you didn't even care. Matron, Seve, and I almost died that night. Have a nice day, Dr. George. <laughs> oh. I spoke to my parents. Oh, you told them? Everything. So, how did they take it? Very badly. It, it was a disaster, actually. I mean, my, my mother couldn't stop crying. Uh, well, that's understandable. <laughs> It's going to be pretty hard to get used to it. Uh, maybe when we meet, I'm sure My that... parents don't want to meet you. They didn't want to speak with you. They made that pretty clear. Yeah, so they said they would just wait for the results of a DNA test to confirm all of this. Maybe if I write to them, explaining how I know that you uh, are... They, they, they just want to get the results of the DNA test. In fact, they wanted me to leave Aji immediately. Oh. I told him I couldn't. Oh. 